today we lost Facebook for a little while and with that went all our discussions, our pictures, posts were put on hold. And so that might be a good time to remind you that we do have an entire community replete with groups, discussions, posts, and your own profile over here in the Thermal Mermaid Network. And this community is exclusively dedicated to DIY soap and cosmetic makers. So everyone over here wants to talk about the same things that you like to do. And I'm going to jump in with a quick announcement to let you know that I have reopened the free membership sign up over there in the crafters community. And we're going to show you some of the new dashboard updates so you can see what I've been expanding over there in your soap and cosmetic crafting community. I do have a better way to keep out the fake accounts now. So as long as all the free members who want to sign up are actually real people, then we're going to try to keep it that way for a long time. Now, you will notice that many of the features and the additional sites on the network are only open to the Mermaid and Siren level members, but there's still a lot to access and nearly all of the community features are open for free sign up. So this means your social profiles, your activity pages, instant message chats, and all the groups that you can join for free. Now, many of you who are already signed up, you may have noticed that your dashboard has drastically changed over the last month and to give you the rundown on what you are looking at, I have recreated an introduction video, which you're about to see in a minute. So if you want to see how much is different, or if you're just curious about what it looks like on the inside of the membership section, then keep watching because I'm going to show you that right now. Now, don't forget to give yourself a profile image when you log in so that other people can recognize you. Your profile can be used to help establish your brand and also link back to your online stores wherever they may be on the internet. So if you are trying to help grow your business, then this might be one tool that you could use to help establish some authority, backlink authority, some page authority, some presence on the internet. It doesn't have to be used that way. It can just be a fun spot to introduce yourself. But if you do want to have some extra place on the internet where you can just help sort of create an identity and help support your brand, then that is what that profile was originally made for. Now, when you do edit your profile, just click this green button on the left and you can upload your image or your avatar. And that way, when you look at the community activity page, you can see directly who's online. And it's not just a dozen of this army of pink mermaids, but you yourself can be seen. Okay, if you're still with me, let's break down everything that you have to look at on your new dashboard. Welcome to the Thermal Mermaid Crafters community. You've just stumbled upon the largest community of handmade soap and cosmetic makers in the world, and you've signed up as either a Kelpie, a mermaid, or a Siren level member. And as a member, there's a lot to look at. I'm Jennifer your guide in the videos and the tutorials that you'll find here in the Thermal Mermaid Soap Makers course and recipe directory. In this introduction, I'm going to give you a tour of all the features, tools, and resources that you can explore while you're here. There's a lot to look at, so sit back and relax, and let's take a look around. The dashboard you've just logged into is a part of the Thermal Mermaid network. This is a collection of websites dedicated to provide resources and community for any DIY hobby crafter or small business like you. There are thousands of pages spread across these websites and I warn you now, I am always building content. This network is always growing and being filled with more resources. I'm always replacing old videos and chopping up other videos and adding more content. So when you come across unfinished pages, be patient. Thermal Mermaid is not a corporation. This is a work of digital art and you are invited to share this space with me. The website that you've logged into where you're watching this video is called cottagediy.com and you can log into your dashboard directly at cottagediy.com or at thermalmermaid.com so you can bookmark either of those two locations. Cottagediy.com is named for the craft that we're working on. Soap making can be a cottage industry that you build from a hobby into your own small business. Depending on how you've signed up will result in how you see your dashboard. Mermaid and Siren levels have access to everything. These are the same levels with two different payment structures, but you get access to everything in this network and there's nothing limited. 
if you're a Kelpie and you signed up for free, you still have access to a tremendous amount, including almost all of the social network features and the first three lessons in the soap making course, which is about 30 lessons, and it'll keep you busy for a very long time. If you're a beginner, this is everything that you need to learn to start soap making, and you'll be practicing for a while before you wanna move on. Your dashboard is broken into four parts. The banner at the top is a display of every site in the Thermal Mermaid network. I'll go into detail about each website in just a moment, but for now I'll tell you that when you are registered as a mermaid or a siren level member, you are registered across all of these websites with the same username and password. Now you do need to log in to some of these websites when you begin to use them, but there's no registration. There's no registration for anyone but you, but you will never have to go through that process. You already registered when you signed up to become a member. You are an exclusive member of every single one of the sites in the network. The second part of this dashboard is for those of you who are looking for a structured course and tutorials. This is the Thermal Mermaid Soap Making Course and Resources. This is a collection of tutorials separated by topic. The lessons in each topic are always growing and we are currently at over 80 tutorials. The third part of this dashboard is the Thermal Mermaid Recipe Directory. Here, we have 12 categories with recipes organized into each category. Each recipe is one that I've made and sold over the years. They're not added until I've made them and tested them. Now included in each recipe are printable instructions, and I do add videos to many of these as I remake them. Since I've started this documented work, I started making videos long after I originally made many of the recipes and products. So as I go back and remake new batches, new videos are recorded and documented and we'll put these up as we go along. Occasionally recipes are donated and photographed by other creators. The fourth section of this dashboard is a quick snapshot of the most recent activity posted by members in the community. Currently we have over 2,000 active members and everyone, including you, has their own profile page where you can add an avatar and any information about yourself that you would like to share with the community. If you look over here to the left, you'll see a short menu. This same avatar and menus I'll point out are at the top of the page as soon as you log in on the right. Here, you can view your community profile, you can edit any information about yourself, an image of how you identify, and you can also click on this button and that will bring you out to our members activity feed. Now this is the full activity feed, so you can see what everyone else is posting on their profiles or in the groups. This social community is a rabbit hole that you can explore when you feel like. You can even browse members, you can see who's online, you can add friends, you can message anyone you like, yes, you can even block and report someone if you need to. So really you can connect to whomever you wish. Now if you look at the bottom of the right, you'll see a pop-up box here. This is where you can see a list of any of your friends that you've connected to who may be online. You can instant message them and you can toggle over to any group that you may have joined and see what's new. Let's take a look at the groups that are set up. Here, I've put up a handful of topics that you can explore and post any thoughts, ideas, or you can reply to other people as they're posting. All members are welcome to interact, and most of these groups are open to both free members and the Mermaid and Siren level members. Some may be exclusive to the Mermaid and Siren level members. Additionally, there's a forum. If you're working with any of the recipes on this website and you have questions pertaining to that work or you just need some help sorting something out, each recipe has a link in the forum where you can ask me anything. Now this is a public forum, so remember, everyone sees it. And there are also some very talented crafters in this community, so there are many people who may jump in with some thoughtful answers. Now you don't need to hunt for the recipe through these threads. The recipe page where you found your recipe will have a direct link to the thread in the forum and you can use that if you need to. Additionally, there are places for other topics and you can start anywhere you like. Now the right hand side of your dashboard has quick links to many of the more popular resources that you have access to. Recently added is a page where contests are posted. Contests will have cash prize winners and only mermaid and siren level members can enter the contests. 
So let's go back to the top of this page where we had that banner that displays the websites in the network. The first box will take you to Thermal Mermaid, our flagship website, where news, updates, and announcements will be made. Now you can always visit this site if you end up getting lost in the web of pages and you need a place to find your dashboard and start over. Now you already know about Cottage DIY, the site where you can access your dashboard. The next site in the network is bathartisan.com. Bathartisan.com is a unique experiment and this may end up being very useful as a new tool for new businesses. This is a marketplace website where you can create your own store and sell your soap and cosmetic. There are a few related categories like candle and jewelry, so you can always utilize those if you happen to make more than just soap and cosmetics. Any mermaid or siren level member is eligible to sell their items on the marketplace. There is no additional fee, no listing fee, and no sales fees to use this resource. Now, as a side note, there are payment processor fees per PayPal, just like anything else you ever use PayPal for, but there are no other fees involved. Now for more information on setting up your store with bathartisan.com, you can check out lesson 11, where I go into much more detail explaining how this works and how you can use it with a full tutorial if you want to. Popping over to the next website in the network, we have soapcraftlabels.com. This website is where you can design labels and make sheets to print out or use the labels that you design to use for professional orders at a print company. Once you create your label, you can get instant access to them and then print them immediately. Again, to access the label designer, you must log in with your username and password and only for the paid membership levels. This is an exclusive website where you can choose from a preset label a size, add your logo, your designs, you can even put on barcodes and QR codes and anything else that you want to add to make your label your own. There is nothing to purchase here. There is no registration allowed on this site. Only you have access to using this resource. And for full tutorials on how to design your labels, you can pop over to lesson eight. Next, we have a wiki resource website, soapcraftwiki.com. Now anyone can use this website to learn and research, but only you can be a wiki editor. Now I have a few ideas as to why I wanted to add this. So this can help build your online authority. Now you have a place to do this. I'll go into more details in a tutorial on soapcraftwiki.com in lesson 10. Next I've built soapcraftmagazine.com. All right, with this one, I'm not gonna lie, this is, a, is an extension of my hobby and it gives me something to pop over on Amazon to sell in paperback form after I do all the work, but this is not meant to be an upsell for you members. That's why I've created a site where you guys can pop over and read a copy of Soapcraft Magazine for free in a digital version to see what soap making nonsense that I've been putting together. So, so far we have one volume. I do plan to have 12 for 2022, but we'll see how far I can push my skills this has shown me that there is a huge learning curve to trying my hand at a new type of media. But whatever I do produce, you guys will have unlimited access so that you can explore it for your entertainment. And finally, in this network, we've created SoapCraftSupplies.com. Now this is a review website that is currently under construction. The website is a place to explore resources where other soap crafters will offer their reviews on products. Reviews submitted are paid opportunities for members to make some extra money and offer their opinions and have a chance to introduce themselves to the community. More information will be rolling out about this within the next month. But to be clear, I do not sell anything. I do not sell products. I do not sell supplies. I do sell my soaps in a little shop, but soapcraftsupplies.com is not a commerce website. It is a review website where you can make some money if you're interested in some of the offers. If you would like to know more about this and how you can make money offering your reviews, then learn more about this in lesson 10. So this is a breakdown on everything that you can find right here on this dashboard. And you're only one click away from all of these features. If you are a Kelpie, you cannot click all the features. Some of these boxes will be gray, but if you are a mermaid or a siren, then you can click away. And one last thing to point out on your dashboard. 
If you scroll down at the bottom of the sidebar on the right hand side, you will see access to your account features. From here, you can control your account. You can cancel, you can upgrade, you can downgrade, you can change your password. You can do anything that you want by playing with the buttons that say manage my account. There are no contracts or fees or any surprises that come along with canceling your account. You are free to click these buttons whenever you want to. And now you're ready to start your journey into lesson one.